productivity. We talk of um, minimum wage. Many Nigerian workers are not productive. Let's be honest. You want a business owner to pay you 100000 when you are not making 100000 for him on a monthly basis. It's, no, it's going to be extremely difficult for that business owner to pay you $1,000 or $100,000 euro when you are not being productive. Many people in Nigeria, they go to their work, they sign in and they leave. They don't produce what is equivalent to their pay. We have to change that mentality. Power. Look at inflation in Nigeria. We, the number one driver of inflation in Nigeria is lack of power. When you, a business owner, is spending more than 60% of your, your revenue on generator and petrol and whatever, tell me how you can't put that in your goods and services that eventually affects people. Okay? Our government has to fix power, roads, security, in order for business owners to stop putting these things or the, the cost on the people. Look at Nigeria. If Ghana can celebrate over 30 years of uninterrupted power supply, it's, it's, it's unconscionable that we Nigerians cannot demand that for our people. Okay? Policies. What are the government policies? Look at all the policies, for example, that have been implemented in the past one year. Instead of these policies to elevate pain, it's even adding pain in the life of people. So these are the four things that we have to focus on as a country in order for us to get out of this quagmire we are in. It, I mean, many of us will live outside Nigeria, and I'm going to round up with this. Many of us will live outside Nigeria. We don't earn minimum wage. Why don't we earn minimum wage? Because when you think of or when you calculate the, 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 um, the benefits that you are adding to your different corporations, you see that you are even paid less. Why? Because you are adding more to that organization. And that's why that organization can afford to pay you minimum wage. What we need in Nigeria is living wage, not minimum wage. And, minim and that living wage has to be tied to productivity. When we are not producing, when Peter Obi said uh, uh, he wants to move Nigeria from a consuming nation to a productive nation, a lot of people laughed at him and said he was a trader. But is it not true today? Is it not true that we have to be productive as, as a country to get out of this mess we are in? Look at India, for example. India is the number one exporter of IT gurus in the world. Why? Because their government many years ago invested in their people. And that's why today in Silicon Valley, 80% of the CEOs or people in top 